was primary one, seven years old, eight years old. I was in the band, primary school band, in my primary school, which is 10 minutes walk away from here. And every Saturday we would have band practice, every Wednesday we would have band practice, and then I would bring back my little cornet, this little trumpet thing. And then I was practicing here. Can you imagine I was practicing in my room? Passion, I think, really doesn't, it's not sufficient. For one success that we see a musician having, he or she probably has faced 99, 999 failures or rejections. You know, this whole thing in Hao Gongming or Chinese education when I was in primary school, always one sentence. Xiao Ming Sui Ran Tong Ming Kusun Lan Duo. Here we are at this sports complex and, and everyone is walking around. Um, my parents come here to swim. For me, it really starts at home. I think this whole word of mouth thing, old fashioned way of uh, of sharing a passion. It's like playing soccer, you know, firstly you have five friends playing together and then you are at the, at the court and then maybe the next day you jail a few other people here and then gradually the club grows. I think it's very important that we go to the heartlands because that's the first stage, the first step that we want to reach out to people. But then it's also equally important that we invite them into our home, which is in, in, in Singapore, it could be the Esplanade Concert Hall, it could be a YST Concert Hall, it could be VCH. It's a matter of context as well. So let's say if su suddenly um, a, a string quartet comes, to, comes over here uh, at the Hawker Centre to perform, uh, do we have a right context if I was here with my parents on a Saturday morning and we're eating and we're in a rush? I think it really depends on setting up the context. And I think that the SSO, there's been a few schemes, you know, us in the neighborhood, the Mother's Day concert at the Botanic Gardens, the Turf Club and, and places like this, which are incredibly meaningful, which I think provides a real context and a real, it's a festive occasion to bring people out to celebrate something together. And then we basically now say, you know, we've come to you, but have you seen the Esplanade before? Maybe not, maybe not my parents, maybe not my grandparents or something, or the grandparents of my friend. And now I would like to say, hey, there's a great hall. It looks like the durian outside, but inside it looks like a spaceship. And let's come in and enjoy the space for one hour, for two hours. I think this is really important. For me, it starts from my own heart, my own belief, and this moving scenario if it goes out to the audience that one time it's more than enough to change people for a lifetime yeah.